What's going on guys? Uh, today is Friday, January 19th. Uh, I have a meet tomorrow and I need a video for today. So I will be just walking through what I'm going to do tomorrow <laughs> when I have to run. Uh, I'm going to be doing this anyway, so I just figured I'd just post it. Uh, so what is this? Oh, I got the schedule. This is today's. I run tomorrow. Uh, I run at 3.10 and 4.30 as long as nothing goes wrong. So I'll just put this like, put another one at 4.30. I'm a very bad typer. Uh, 60 here, finals. And then at three, pretty much we'll do 60 meter freedoms. All right, so here I did this and it's not very pretty. Let's just, uh, I guess, I don't know. Add a little spice to it. What the hell? Images of running. Oh, it's videos. I'm stupid. All right, here we go. Uh, wrap text. There we go. Even better. All right, so 8 a.m. I wake up probably a little later than that, but I'll say 8 a.m. for simplicity's sake. And then normally we have a shake out at nine. Um, I normally have like a little snack in here, so I can just put like, I don't know, like breakfast slash snack, but I really don't want to eat till like after I shake out. And this is like a shake out. And so would this be, it'd be like for maybe like an hour or two. And then after that, now I'm going to get like my, my meal. So for me, like this is probably the hardest part about like planning out your day for like a meat day is like when you're going to eat. And for me, I have a hard time like eating, like being hungry. So I kind of just have to like eat whenever I get hungry. But if I had to plan it out, I would put it like three hours, four hours before I run because I don't want to eat right before I run. And I don't want to eat here because then I'll be hungry right before I run. So I want to get like that, that medium spot. So I'll probably get hungry like after I race. So I would probably get my meal in. You can call it breakfast or lunch or whatever you want to call it. But uh, yeah, get a meal in at 11 o'clock, uh, 12 o'clock, probably just hanging out. Maybe just, um, maybe still eating your meal at that point. Just no rush at all. And then at one o'clock, that's when I go to the track. We go to the track two hours before we run. So head to track. And then from here until I warm up at two, I'll put warm up. I normally warm up 45 minutes to an hour before I run. So I'll put warm up right there. But like from here, one, two, I'll put like one, uh, 30 just have like a little in between time but this isn't like strict just in there somewhere I'm so bad at typing oh my goodness um just do my, like my training and like not training but like treatment kind of stuff like uh some things I like to do I like, I like to get like heat pads on my muscles especially the ones that like I struggle with like I have really weird adductors like they I don't know, they get hurt really easy, so I like to warm those up really well. My hip flexors, since they fire so much really quick, uh, I use them there on uh, my hip flexors and my, my hamstrings. I get a lot of heat on my hamstrings. Just those like important muscles that are very easy to get hurt. Uh, so I'll get treatment, you know, I'll just put like heat slash scraping is also a good one if you're a little sore, you know, getting some like scraping in can get out those little like uh aches and pains sometimes um yeah then i warm up and then obviously run on the 60. i want to be doing sprint drills like 
like sprint drills, I'm, I'm about to start sprinting. I want to do sprint drills like 240. Uh, I'll say 230. And I'll say at 245. I need to have spikes on. You know, get some run outs, get some uh, block starts. Get ready for the 60. And then run it and then, you know, hang out with my family or you know, just get some more treatment and get ready for the finals. I won't say hang with family, I'll just say get treatment. Prep for finals. I'm gonna speed up these times I'm typing because that takes forever. I'll play 30 for this. Other thing I'm doing too, which I should put in here is I, I take ibuprofen the day of my meet. I don't take it like for practice or anything, but I take it during the meet. So I'll wake up and I'll probably get like ibuprofen with my breakfast or snack. And then like, I don't know, like during my meal, I'll make sure I get some type of like caffeine, like a Red Bull or something I like Red Bulls right now, so. I spelled caffeine wrong. You guys probably think I'm an idiot. Uh, but yeah, prep for finals and then do it kind of like the same warm up. But honestly, for like uh, getting ready for a final is a lot easier. It's a whole lot less to warm up because you're not really warming up again. You're just like, um, I don't know how to call it. Like, you're already warmed up. You just have to kind of like refresh it. I guess so I don't even really do much I just do maybe some like static stretches and then get into some sprint drills and do some blocks so I guess I can say that um, light static stretch and uh, sprint drills. And then I get in my run outs and everything and get into the blocks just like I did for the prelim. And after that, I mean, I get treatment again and pretty much just watch the rest of the meet the rest of the day or do any interviews or anything that might come up. But uh, after that, I mean, I'm pretty much clocked out I don't really I don't really like doing a cooldown much I sometimes will do it but like yeah I don't, I'm not a huge like believer in cooldowns maybe that's a hot take maybe that's why I get hurt so much but <laughs> I don't get hurt that much normally I get hurt like when I get hurt it'd be like after I run like I'll run the race I'll run up the bank and get hurt like I don't get hurt during the race normally so I, I don't know that's weird but uh, yeah, I don't, I'm not a big believer in cooldowns, so I'll just hang out the rest of the day pretty much. I don't even need to put that. That's pretty much the end of my day, honestly. I'll probably get a meal in right here. And I mean, that's really it, honestly. Oops. Um, but hey, I got this now. So I got little mics. So I actually could film myself doing this if I wanted to. It's me. Oh yeah, there we go. Some female representation. Um, I could feel myself doing this. If you guys want to see that, just uh, you know, let me know. Uh, I got them for a reason, so I'm probably gonna do that either way. But uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope this helped at all. It's, I mean, this is gonna help me figure out what I need to do for tomorrow. I need to plan it out anyway. I don't even know what time I ran until like. You know 20 minutes ago so <laughs> uh let's see i haven't seen these yet there i am all right well should be fun should be 
a cool mate. There's a lot of people here, so that'd be fun. Wiz is normally pretty sick. Last year we it was a pro meet. I think we didn't like sign up for it to be a pro meet this year, so nobody like huge is coming. Like no like pro runners or whatever. But there's still some good talent here. Like I'm gonna have a lot of fun running against these guys, and I know I know a lot of these guys. And I, Indian Hills is here obviously too, so I'll get to see my old coach and that'll be fun. It's always fun seeing um, old coaches or old teammates. So, and I, I think my fam family and friends are going to come. It's a home meet, so those are always exciting too. There's a lot of fun races to watch here. I think, how do I go back? This one's what I'm excited for. Where's it at? Yes. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That'd be a fun one to watch. Um, other than that, I think that's all I want to do for this video. Um, I might make another video tomorrow. I didn't post on Monday because I'm an idiot and just put it off. I guess I did that today too, but this is going to be a very unprofessional video. <laughs> so, oh, I guess all my videos are because, you yeah, know, whatever. But let me stop rambling. I need to stop. But I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Hope this helped. Uh, I'll see you next time.